The glaucous wing gull is a large gull that is a year-round resident of Washington and is usually found along the coastline and also inland in urban areas, often at dumps or fast food parking lots. Some distinguishing features are its pink legs and gray wingtips with the subterminal white spots. Also, they have a red spot on their bill, which is thought to be used by their young as a spot to peck at and solicit feeding from their parents. This bird takes four years to reach adult plumage, and the juveniles look similar to the juveniles of other large four-year goals, and identification between immature goals can be very tricky. Hybridization occurs between this species and several other large goal species, including the western goal and the herring goal. The range of the glaucous wing goal goes from Baja, California, and all the way up the Pacific coast to the Aleutian Islands in Alaska. They've even been known to winter as far as Japan and Russia. <coughs> Gulls usually live to be about 10 years old, but have been known to live to up to 30. They nest in the same place and breed with the same mate for most or all of their life. They nest from April to August and have between one and five eggs. There's estimated to be about 400,000 birds. The glaucous wing gull is considered to be a species of least concern. It's not endangered or threatened, and actually it's considered by many to be a nuisance. The rate of population growth has slowed in the last 10 years, and in Washington state, population has only increased slightly, but the investment in egg production has decreased in the last 10 years. The population in the Salish Sea has decreased in abundance by 25% between the late 70s and early 2000s. So while population raised significantly in the last century, more recent studies indicate a change and we have yet to identify and understand all the various influences that cause these changes. Some studies suggest that the increase in numbers of bald eagles and their predation on breeding gull colonies may be a major contributing factor to the decline and abundance of the glaucous wing gulls in the Strait of Georgia. The next 10 years will be a critical time to monitor population trends. For more information on the glaucous wing gull and other species of birds that can be found on the campus of Evergreen State College, go to blogs.evergreen.edu slash birds. And that's what I get for uh, feeding the gulls. <laughs>